Come in, have a look. Well, this is her. It's fun. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> one thing, Cap. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Birch bark going. Now I'm flaring up. Hi there, welcome to the Newfoundland Outsider. And today we're back at the little remote cabin, our little half grid cabin here. My wife Denise is with me and her brother David is with me this time. And we got a nice jig zinner plan for tonight. So it should be a good trip. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can uh, keep up with all the upcoming videos coming up. Just barely made it through. I don't got my rod, so we just use the hook and worm. Ooh, a lot of water here. So all I'm using here is just a little worm and a, a floating lid. Put it all the way to the bottom, like that. About there, and bring it up three or four inches. And I use a, a little bow. I keep it right centered in the hole. And when you come by, if the bow is moved, there's a fish there. Yeah, perfect.
Okay, so today we're gonna to try a couple lakes around here. One down the west here and one up to the north. We're just gonna try a couple lakes for ice fishing, try our luck. So David and I are off drilling some moles and chicken the dips and looking for some good locations. I'll take all the tools off the bottom. You go up that way. Okay, so I decided to wait on the ceiling. Uh, we'll do that next time. So this time we're gonna take everything out of the second room and get it ready for repairs for next time and renovations. Oh, lots. Those are the
So I got the room all cleaned out. I got these walls insulated. There were some parts missing, so I insulated that and insulated below the window. And that one over there is already insulated, ready to go. So I just need to do some vapor barrier now and start building this bedroom. I also got to move this little electrical box. I'll move that up, up further. And I'll get some panel board and cover it all. Today we're making Jig's dinner and I'm going to put some salt meat on the boil right now and then I'll peel the vegetables, carrot, turnip, cabbage, potatoes and it all goes in one pot and we uh, cook it all up and then we eat it. Do we have anything with it? Um, we got some moose meat there to have with it. This is a good piece of salt meat. This is, yeah. There's not much fat on that. Yeah, mostly meat. How long we need that ball, Denise? Half an hour. So we need half an hour for the salt beef, half an hour for the cabbage. And then half an hour for the rest. Half an hour for the rest. Okay, with this Jig's dinner, we're gonna have some, we're gonna have a junk of moose meat. So I'll get it ready now and put it in the little roaster and we'll put it on the wood stove and cook it. We're gonna have some olive oil. And some salt. Yeah. I'm hoping there's gonna be enough heat here for to bake that meat there. Okay, we gotta add our cabbage. Boil that for half an hour. Looks good. Yeah, nice and tasty. Jig's dinner. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Do you like the mustard pickles? Yeah. Tasty. This is the best part anyway. Yeah. Guys should start with dessert. If you're yeah. full after that, add some veggies. Yeah. Got both. 
Too good, boy. Too good. What? Too good. <laughs> yeah. Let's check on our rabbits, see how they're doing. I put this little birch tree here the last time I was in. You can see they were all around it. And they got all the tops chewing off. They chew them off so precise, like a pair of scissors. And you can see their tracks over there. They come up here. They come right there and pause. <laughs> and then they run across here and go on to the cabin. So yesterday was a beautiful day. So David and I came down, we tried all along the shore. We tried over on that side where the brook runs in and where the brook runs out. But no luck on the trout. We got lots of little ones, so nothing big to keep. Um, so I'm back here this morning. I thought the weather changed. We might change something up in the fishing. Maybe some bigger ones will come around. So we're trying again this morning, and I got a little one in this hole again. <laughs> so we'll try all the holes that I drilled yesterday and see if we get any more luck today. A little brookie. That one go. Okay, I got one on. Whew, got a bit of weight to this one too. Whew, feels like a nice one. Holy, a heel. I've never caught in a heel. Huh. I've never caught in a heel ice fishing before. Wow. Oh wow. That's a first. I have never caught in a heel ice fishing before, ever. Wow. I didn't even think they would bite ice fishing. Yep, they bite. I caught lots in the summer.
that's it for another episode of the, uh, Newfoundland Outsider. Uh, thanks for David coming along, Denise's brother David for coming along. We had a great trip. Yeah, we'll see you next time. Thank you.